Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to be talking about theming with this Fedora Atomic Budgie that I've been running for the last week. And by and large the way you theme is you right click on the desktop and you go to Budgie Desktop Settings. Now what you're looking for is in here you've got a list of themes. Now by default you don't get very much. You get this material theme, you get the high contrast and then that's about it. That's that's all you get. So looked around to see how you go about theming Fedora Atomic and it's not immediately obvious what you have to do so the first thing I tried was installing from the gnomelooks.org website but the thing is because you are in an Atomic distribution and you have no write capabilities even as root in certain folders you can't actually update the folders to put the themes in there and even putting them in the dot themes under your own user does not change the theme and allow you to select it. So that um, was, was a bit of a problem for me. So I've read some articles online and the first one I looked at was GNOME Tweaks because uh, Budgie is based on GNOME so the GNOME tweak should work. So if I go to appearance here you'll see that I've actually got Add waiter set up as the theme, which is why when you're in here, it doesn't show up under the widgets. It's, it, I'm not sure why that is. It feels like a bug to me. But you can see I've also installed um, these mint themes, and so that's what I want to show you today is how I, I managed to actually install these themes because it's not immediately obvious. And now if I want to get back to Add waiter, I can't do that here. I, I have to go into GNOME Tweaks as this, and then I have to go back here and then find the a waiter theme again I don't want the dark one and the reason I want to do this is I struggle with dark themes I know a lot of people like dark themes but uh, I, I struggle because of poor eyesight that so I need the lights the light theme uh, I need to blind myself even further so here we go um, you see I've got this light theme and uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to open up a terminal window and let's see if we can make it larger so I've made the terminal larger and the command you're looking for is called RPM OS tree if I move my cursor up you can see the commands I searched before so you've got this RPM OS tree and if you search and you search on the word theme and then pipe it out to more you'll get a list of themes now it isn't immediately obvious which ones are actually themes you can install for um, making your desktop look good but you can see you've got add waiter there, you've got breeze um, and the one I installed was uh, the mint themes um, but you can do cinnamon themes, uh, candy icon theme, mate themes, arc, uh, so we've got breeze gtk so now I don't know which one is the one that we want to do here so let's, let's try doing breeze gtk and so if I install you can see it's going to check out a tree, it's then going to install it all but it won't actually become active until you reboot your computer so that's kind of annoying as well. Every time you install something from this RPM OS tree it seems to require a reboot of your system. So you can see it's downloading from updates, it's downloading from Fedora, it's importing the packages, uh, checking out packages and now you can see it's writing an OS tree commit. It is now staging the deployment. As you can see, it's now saying uh, changes queued for next boot and run system control reboot to start a reboot. So I'm going to do that now. Right, so here I am, I'm back in. So now let's if we go into the budgie desktop settings. Hopefully we should. Well, you can see that breeze didn't show up there. So let's go into tweaks and there's Breeze now so if it doesn't show up in the budgie settings you can usually find it in the tweak settings and you can see there's Breeze now installed so one thing you'll need to do if you haven't already installed it uh, if you want to be able to change your themes via tweaks is obviously install tweaks now tweaks can be installed by the software manager so in here you just type tweaks if you go into GNOME Tweaks you can see I've already got it installed uh, if you didn't that would be an install button you just click install and then you can open up from here or you can open up in the menu 
uh, any way you like. And that's how you can change the themes within Fedora Atomic. Whether you're using Budgie or one of the other distributions, I assume that will work for Silver Blue, and I think it'd probably work for Kanoite as well. Um, and that's the end of the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you next time on Everyday Linux User.